Now, the Kenya National Commission on Human Rights has launched its fourth state of human rights report detailing the country's status since the promulgation of the 2010 constitution. The report highlights what the commission has called alarming rise in extrajudicial killings, disappearances and arbitrary arrests. Let's take a look at a summary of the findings now. And as you see there on your screen, there's access uh, to justice and the positive steps uh, that require to be taken. Also, right to life, uh, extrajudicial killings and disappearances uh, that have been experienced in the past. We've had human rights uh, groups come in and uh, civil society groups as well talking about this. Uh, and also the uh, shoot to kill orders. We saw one in Baringo uh, a while back uh, that had been issued in the coast. We have had the commissioner there as well at some point uh, refer to those. So this is some of the areas that uh, the human rights uh, are talking about in their report in terms of access to information these are stories that we've seen make it in the news uh, and access to information especially for all to the journalists as they seek to uh, be able to unearth some of the corruption or uh, atrocities that go on in a country or in the world access to information is one of the things that is very important arbitrary arrest of demonstrators and imposition of high bail terms to demonstrators and as far as the freedom of assembly is concerned are the other areas uh, that this uh, touches on also security human rights violations by state security agents and in uh, the laws we saw a while back that the court had to uh, put to a halt some of those proposals uh, because of the measures and the uh, extent to which uh, the authorities wanted to go and of course there's that big one uh, corruption and bribery continues to be a huge challenge and problem in the country so these are the areas that the Kenya National Commission on Human Rights uh, commission is talking about as they launch uh, their report uh, detailing the status uh, since the promulgation of the constitution.